Hey friends, so today's scenario is the doctor has planned for the patient to be on a variable rate. So what are the indications for patients who are diabetic or hospital related hyperglycemia who are unable to take oral food or fluid and for whom adjustment of their own insulin regime is not possible. Where the patient is vomiting nearby mouth means they're missing more than one meal or severely ill with the need to achieve good control of the blood sugar. Before starting to prepare, make sure that you have the valid prescription. Start date and the doctor's signature must be written. In our trust, we use colored yellow prescription for diabetic charts. Prepare your two pumps, syringe pump and fluid pump. The prescribed fluids, fluid IV line and infusion line, 50 ml syringe, normal saline, insulin syringe to draw the insulin from the vial, and a three-way port. This will compose of two set of infusion. First infusion as prescribed is 50 units of actropid mixed with 49.5 ml normal saline in a 50 syringe mills. Connect to the infusion line and prime it. Second infusion depends on the prescription. In this demo, doctor has prescribed 0.45 normal saline, 5% glucose, 3% potassium in a 500 ml bag to run for 6 hours. During the preparation and giving of medication, two registered nurse must check and sign together the infusion of intravenous insulin at a variable rate is according to our regular capillary blood glucose measurements with the aim of controlling sugar glucose levels within a specific range. Connect both lines to the three-way port and before starting, check the latest blood sugar so you will know which rate you will set the pump.
hope this video was helpful subscribe and i will see you in the next video bye